all right guys welcome back uh, i'm lost I'm, I'm not at the beach <laughs> uh the the surf fishing's been dead so i decided it was time to break the kayak out out here at lake shelby which is literally across the street from the gulf of mexico here in gulf shores so i'm gonna see what i can get done throwing some shrimp on a popping cork today so let's see thought i saw a little speck hit just behind there a little trout There we go. All right. What do we got? Get out from under the boat. Get out from under the boat. Oh my goodness. Big old pinfish to start the day. Good night. Big old chunk of a pinfish to start the day. <laughs> that's, that's eating size. I mean, you could eat that guy, but we're gonna put him back. See if we can find something a little higher quality. Okay. Threw the anchor out. Oh, threw that, threw that shrimp right off. Gosh dang it. Let's let's try that again. Get him rigged up here. I went ahead and got three dozen of them just because of that today. Just uh just knowing I'm gonna throw several off, so. I came prepared. Oh, nope. I thought something already. Okay, maybe something did get hooked up. Ah, came off. Dang it. Ah, I thought that went a little sideways on me there. It's all right. Well, we'll get another shrimp on there. We'll throw that right back out there. I like that spot. I, that's a little bit better fish there. There we go. Yeah. That's a little, a little better fish than the pinfish I caught a minute ago. Yeah. It's not a giant, but, but definitely, definitely better than what I had a moment ago. Ah. Get in that net, get in that net. There we go. All right, that is a, a solid red right there. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, that's a slot red. Heck yeah. All right. All right. That is what we are after. Heck yeah not a giant by any means but exactly the fish we're after today we're, we're after the slot and he's no doubt a slot and just because we always want to follow the law we're going to put him on here he's at 21 perfect absolutely perfect exactly what we wanted and i'm keeping a, a death grip on this guy with the way i'm I didn't bring my fish grips today. I, I meant to bring them, but I don't have them, so. We're gonna get him tossed in here. Great start to the morning. All right, all I'm doing right now is feeding pinfish. So, I might be moving spots here pretty quickly because I'm only gonna let them take so many shrimp before I'm sick of it. All right, sitting here in one spot, not being productive anymore. Just pin fish, just hammer away at my shrimp. So I'm gonna do a little, do a little research, do a little discovering while I'm out here. So let's move. Got hooked up again after we moved. I'm, I'm, I'm not able to run the GoPro while I'm fishing. Oh my goodness, look at that bluegill. Oh, wow. That's a stud bluegill. Or as they're called down here, brim. 
Ah, he's peeing all over me. Yeah, I believe I'm gonna hold on to you too, buddy. Man, you swallowed that. That's the only bad thing about these short hooks. I'm not able to leave the GoPro running the entire time I'm fishing today because I forgot to charge up batteries. So I've only got so much battery today. I didn't realize that until I let my first two batteries run down and then now I'm down to just one left. So not gonna run it the entire time I'm, I'm fishing this like I wanted to, but it is what it is. Up again, another nice bluegill. Well, I didn't exactly plan on catching bluegill today, but I'm not gonna complain. I mean, at least they're solid gills. And yes, I'm gonna continue to call them bluegill. I'll probably never call them brim, but <laughs> not bad. This is the bad part about a prop drive. It don't work when it's packed full of grass. And it's really, really choppy out here today. And I cannot see this grass until I am caught in it. I mean, it's, as soon as I see it, boom, my, my prop's stuck and I've got to keep cleaning it out. So that's real fun. All right. Let's add a largemouth bass to the species today. Too cool. Add in a largemouth bass to the other species. That's that's awesome. <laughs> Not really what I expected, but I, I was kind of trolling a little bit right here and just happened to get a couple real quick hits and decided well let me slow down and and actually cast out here and hooked up all right and there is a little break from the surf it's it's not going to be a, a super common thing um it might be a little more common throughout the winter months just because the the inshore fish can usually be a little more productive if you can get on the fish but i'm going to be right back out in the surf so this is not going to be an everyday thing by any means um but overall, great day. I'm happy with the way it turned out. Came out, caught the redfish that I was targeting, so awesome. But I'm going to wrap this up, so until next time, I'll see you later.